Yo, what was that? Horseshoe. Oh, it's all barbed wire fence. No idea what this is. Piece to a car frame. Are you freaking kidding me? What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we're gonna be doing some more magnet fishing. I don't know if you can hear it, but my voice is gone, destroyed. We are going to be magnet fishing at a spot that looks amazing. And last time Joe and Danny were here, they actually pulled up 22 artillery shells, like bombs, like whole bombs they found at this bridge. So we're gonna be magnet fishing here. That is one thing that I have never found before. Any form of explosive, at least that I'm aware of. We're gonna take our giant 360 magnets. We're gonna be throwing them off this bridge and we're gonna see what we can find. If you guys would like to check out what magnets I'm using, I'm using the Battle Magnet. If you guys do not know, Battle Magnets is actually my company. It allows me to travel and do what I love every single day because of your guys' support. If you guys would like to check it out, link is down in the description. Pick up yourself a magnet and get into this awesome hobby called magnet fishing. Let's get right into the video. Let's see what we can find. I do have to say the bugs are pretty, pretty bad today here. <laughs> it looks like it can also rain at any given second today. So we're gonna see how it goes. Okay. <laughs> We're taking the first throw of the day. Oh man, there's so many of these magnetic rocks up here. It is ridiculous. Here we go. This feels a little bit heavier. Oh, dude, I got a horseshoe. There we go. First rock. find of the day, horseshoe. Oh, we're gonna have good luck today. Everybody's finding stuff all around. All right, we're gonna take another throw. Oh, we got something. Is it a freaking clam? Are you kidding me, bro? I caught a clam. It got wedged on the magnet from this little piece of metal right here. Oh no. Oh, well, it just broke. Well, I had a freaking clam. How many clams have been caught magnet fishing before? I don't know. That's my first clam. Oh, this feels heavier. What is this thing? Straight down there. Oh my gosh. It's a freaking boulder, bro. I don't understand why there's so much these big rocks that are coming up. That is ridiculous. I thought I had something. That is literally a rock. Oh my gosh, that was a magnet full of crap right there. Oh, it's all barbed wire fence. Wow, <laughs> that is a lot of barbed wire right there. Jeez, I'm like scared to grab it. Like, where can I grab it? Oh, these are like nails with daggers on them. Oh, there we go. I got a spoon right there. Second spoon I found in two days. All right, we'll take it. We're currently going to head to a new bridge right now. We didn't find too much stuff. We got a couple horseshoes, a couple cool things, but we are going to see if we can try our luck at another bridge. One interesting thing about this spot is someone actually had passed away here. It was pretty recent, so we're going to be back to fishing at the spot where they found someone wrapped up in a rug and thrown into the river. <sighs> I hope we don't find anything like that today. My biggest fear diving and magnet fishing is pulling up a body. I do not want to see that. I don't want to be any, anywhere a part of that. We're going to get into magnet fishing. Oh, I got something coming. Oh, what is this thing? All right, well, I got something big. The thing is heavy. Oh, I have no idea what it is, but my magnet just stuck to the thing. It is just a little piece of paneling. All right, we'll take it. Oh, here we go. This is a good weight too, brother. What is this? Oh, man. No idea what this is. Oh, there's numbers on it. Danny's got more rebar. I will take it. Oh, here we go. I got something all the way out there. And I picked up something right there. Oh, geez, it knocked it off. Are you kidding me? We got a just a bunch of scrap metal right there. But man, I had something bigger on there. And then whatever this thing is right there, clicked it. Yo, get up here. What is this? It's a piece of the bridge, I think. Oh my gosh, man. Ah! What is it, a car frame? Piece to a car frame, I guess. Dang, that thing is big. Dang, he thinks it's a piece to a car frame. Could be. Dude, I got a whole axle to a car. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, bro. Oh, with the rim. Yo, are you freaking kidding me, dude? This is huge. No, it's right here. It's got the whole axle and everything. Ugh. Danny, can you help me get my magnet off this? All right, thank you, Danny Dip. Man, that's crazy. A whole freaking car axle. I really wonder if there's a whole scrap car down there. Now, I am convinced that that's a car frame. I had my suspicions, but I think that's probably true. Oh, there we go. We got something coming up. Oh, it's a piece of chain. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Thing is sick. Big old piece of chain right there. Something big right here. Glides on up it, though. Oh, it's just a piece of rebar, I think. And that is why... I will never ever jump off a bridge again because that piece of rebar is about three inches submerged standing straight up after some of the stuff that I found I will never ever jump off a bridge again. Oh, there's something big right here. Here we go. We got something big coming. What is this thing? Oh, it's another piece to the frame right there. It's literally the same exact shape. Look at that. 
two pieces of the frame, an axle. We're gonna have this whole thing by the time we are done here. Oh my nails, here we go. Look at all these nails right here. A big old nail hole right there. Oh, we got something all the way out there too. Now it just popped off, are you kidding me? I'm gonna take another throw out there and see if I can get it again. Oh, there it is. Yo, I got the muffler. No, dude, I had the muffler. This is something different. This isn't even what I had. This was straight down. Uh, this is completely different than what I had before. Oh my gosh. All right, well, we got two of these like weird little U-shaped pieces of metal. We were finding these yesterday too. We gotta drop this straight down again. We gotta see if we can get this muffler up. Is this it? No, it's not. Well, this isn't a muffler, but it's three more of those. No, I lost one. I'm probably gonna get that on the drop down. What are these things? And why is there so many of them? One, two, and the third one fell in the water, but that is still not the muffler. Oh my gosh, is it two more of those same things I just pulled up? It is, are you serious? What is with all these things? Come on, I'm going for the muffler, man. I'm going for the muffler. Oh my gosh, it's like three of them, bro. Why is there so many? I pulled up like a dozen already. I'm just trying to get my muffler, man. I'm gonna show you how stupid this is right now. Ready? Down, straight up. No! I'm trying to get the muffler. That's how stupid this thing is, bro. I keep finding another one. Let's see what Joe's got here. Oh man, who knows what that was? It's like a piece of the bridge. It was a long, long beam. Look at everything that we've gotten so far just right here. Like a dozen or so of these little beam things. And then this like axle, crazy. Get it, get it. It's completely out of the water now. Oh, I can almost grab it. Ah! <laughs> Yo, I have no idea what this thing is. <laughs> This thing is massive. Oh my gosh. I did not think it was that big. I'm not even gonna lie. That thing is Animal. freaking huge, bro. Oh, there we go. We got a piece of paneling, it looks like. It could be a piece of the car. <laughs> you never know. Man, at this rate, we'll pull up the whole freaking thing. Oh, this is a good weight coming up. Yo, what do we got here? I have no idea what this is. It's a bunch of things. We got this little yellow looking thing and then just pieces of scrap metal. We're having a great day of magnification. I don't know what this is. That is weird looking right there. It's kind of rounded, hollow, a cap to something maybe. Yo, this is big. Yo, what was that? That thing was huge. That thing's gone though. Well, I literally just pulled up the muffler right here. Man, it only took two million of these little U pieces of metal to get that thing up, but we got it. Just like that, that is gonna wrap up today's video. We have found an insane amount of stuff today. We had to jump bridges a couple times, but we ended up getting on a very, very good spot. I was actually pulling up huge pieces to a scrapped car from the axle and the rim and a whole bunch of these weird looking U-shaped pieces of metal. We also found brackets to the car frame as well, so we had a phenomenal day today. Anyways, I'm gonna let you guys go. So, thanks for watching. See ya.